Yesterday, I told a lie. And I didn't tell a lie, you know, in writing. I did not tell a lie on camera to you guys. I told a lie face to face in person in front of my wife to some of our friends. And that lie was, I don't care what people think about me. I don't care what people say about me. And that was a lie. And I'm glad that it is. But before I dive into it, I want to frame the correct context. Now, it is important to understand that everyone has an opinion and not everyone's opinion is valuable in your life. But when I say I don't care what people say about me, well, I guess we should address the elephant in the video right now. It's why in the heck am I dressed like this? Joanna and I, we just got done with our walk. And that's when this idea came to me. As I'm walking in the morning, I often like to reflect on the previous 24 and either check a box, was yesterday successful? Did I do what I needed to do? Or were there some shortcomings? And then I, I play back the conversations and the interactions I had. So that's why I'm dressed like this. Uh, go Troy, men of Troy. And I wanted to get that, uh, this idea out to you all immediately. Now, um, when I'm talking about caring what people say about you, I'm talking about a word that we often use for celebrities. We often use this after they've retired or after they've passed away, and that word is legacy. And the legacy is what do people say about you? What is your lasting impact or the thought that they have about you? And as I was walking today, the reason I said that I lied is because I really do care what people say about me. Now, the key is I care what the right people say about me, what the important people say about me, my family, my friends, me being a man of faith. I care what God says about me and what he thinks of me. And so I want to ask you if people, if do you, first of all, do you care what people say about you? And if you do, do you think what they're saying about you lines up with what you want them to say? Would someone say that you're an honest person? Would they say that you're caring or would they say that you're arrogant? Would they say that you're reckless or thoughtful? Uh, maybe some of your closest friends say, well, he has an attitude, but that's just who he or she is. Let me ask you again, what's your legacy? Now, while I ask what is your legacy, let me tell you what a legacy is not. A legacy is not a piece of paper that's locked away in a safe or a safety deposit box for those to read after you are gone. Your legacy is and are the actions that you're doing every day. Your legacy today is the decisions that you're making. Your legacy today are the relationships that you build. Your legacy today are the lies that you choose not to tell and the integrity that you have when no one else is watching. So I want to pose this question to you one more time. Do you care what people say about you and what are they saying? If you don't know, do like I do, ask questions. I ask my family, my friends, my clients, my peer reviews, what do you think of when you think of me? What's the one word? I know I want to have a legacy of faith. I want to have a legacy of consistency. I want to have a legacy of fun, but I'm basing my actions today on what I want said about me later today and tomorrow. Hopefully you'll put some thought into what are people saying about you and hopefully you do care what the right people say about you. Remember, I love you, God loves you, and there's nothing you can do about it. And until next time, don't be average, be world renowned. Peace. I've got to go shower and get dressed up. Bye.